Girl, you call me by my name The love you give me, I just can't deny Yeah, No longer blinded, I can see you Hi my loves, welcome back to my channel if you are a returning subscriber. If you are new, hi, hello, how are you? I'm Jasmine and on this channel we talk all about faith in Jesus Christ, lifestyle, and so much more. So what are you waiting for? Come join the fam, we would absolutely love to have you. So from my Kindle video, one question that I was getting quite often was how did I get this lock screen? and i'm gonna teach you guys how to do it today so let's just stop talking and get right into the video okay so we have a couple of websites that we need to open up before we even start the actual process of creating our design so what you want to do is you want to first open up the canva.com which all of these will link be linked down below so you guys can just click on each one so you won't even have to like type them in or anything and then the next website you're going to need is called convertio.co and then the next website you're going to want to open is onlineconverter.com and the one that we specifically want is change epub cover and then the last website we're going to need to open is the amazon.com forward slash send to kendall okay so those are all of our websites that we will need so let's just get into it so i have already created my design here let me just find it so we're gonna go back to canva and we are going to pull up our design and when you do your design you're going to want it to be in 180 to a 1440 okay that is the dimensions that we need to create this this screen okay so this is the one that i have already created as you guys can see the one that i have up here is one that i have already um shown you guys in my kindle video but i did make a new one in advance to this video and you just want to make sure that everything fits really well i was gonna um put that just kind of size everything the way that i want it to um to have it okay okay and for the Kindle most people that you'll see um, do tutorials they'll tell you to change your screen to black I recommend black but you can always change your screen to white and then use black as like the main color for like the photos and stuff like that um, remember that the Kindle is only in black and white so whatever you do is going to show up in black and white only okay so once you have your um, your picture the way you want it we're gonna go ahead and save it and we want to save it as a PNG or we're going to download it anyways. We're going to download it as a PNG. And then I just want the one picture. And then we're going to download. Okay. Then we're going to go to our Convertio.co. And we're going to um, upload the file that we just downloaded from Canva onto Convertio. okay and then we're gonna hit convert and then we're going to download the file so now you can see we have the PNG from Canva and now we have an EPUB file as well so we're going to go to our next website which is onlineconverter.com slash change epub cover and the first thing we're going to do is we're going to um, upload the epub file we just got from convertio
and then the next thing is we're going to also upload the png that we got from canva because this is going to be our cover page for the epub file what we're basically doing is we're kind of like making our own ebook because that's pretty much what it is okay and then we're going to change the size to full and then we're going to convert and then we're going to click download now okay and now we have our um, our EPUB so now what we're gonna do is we're going to go to amazon.com slash send to Kindle and you're gonna want to log into your Kindle or your Amazon account and then we're going to go to select file from device then we're going to find our EPUB file here here we are and this is kind of the longest part um, and we're going to send it to our Kindle okay and it says your files are on the way and it's processing And while this is processing, I just want you guys to know that if you guys have ads on your Kindle, this is not going to work. In order for this to work, you have to have an ad-free Kindle. You can always call Amazon and get your ads removed. Some people say that they've done it without having to pay. They just let Amazon know that, hey, these um, ads are inappropriate. I don't like seeing them. I have children, da 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 da, and they get removed uh, for free. And I've also heard people say that they had to pay $20 to get the ads removed. So that is all you. But in order to do this, you have to get the ads removed first. This is not going to work if you do not have the ads removed okay and it's still processing so we're still waiting on that but if you guys do have an ad free kindle um you're gonna want to go to settings to set this up so you want to go to settings and then you want to go to screen and brightness and then the first option on your device should be show covers on lock screen. And you just want to turn that on so you'll start seeing your uh, book covers and EPUB files, which we are doing right now. Um, you'll see that when you turn your Kindle off or you turn your Kindle into like sleeping mode. So mine's on and it looks like the e-file just downloaded. So we're going to open up. This is what it's gonna look like. I don't know if you guys can see that. I'm sorry for the glare. But right here, you see that EPUB file? We're gonna click on it. We're gonna click on it again. And boom, there is our new Kindle screen. And the way that you want to do this is it needs to be like you've read the whole book. So I'm going to just click it one more time until it's this color, okay? And then when you turn off your Kindle, it'll pop up just like that. Boom, and there you go. And that is how you create your own Kindle screensaver. If you guys have any other questions, leave them down in the comments down below. I would be happy to answer any more of your questions. Um, if you guys like videos like this, definitely like, comment, share, and subscribe. Um, I would love to hear what you guys would love to see next, and I'll see you guys next Wednesday for the next video. Bye. I'm on my way to meet you. We gotta talk. Tribulations got me tired. I